Hey guys, welcome to Cute Tea Drawings. Today I'll be drawing a pineapple owl. I'll be drawing on my tablet, but you can also follow along on paper, and please remember to like and subscribe. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, let's first start off in the middle, and let's draw the beak. Let's start with a V-shaped point up and down. And then a longer one underneath. And then inside, at the points, let's draw a small black curve on both sides for the nostrils. Next, let's hop out and let's draw a circle on both sides for the eyes. And then let's move in and let's draw another circle inside each one. And then let's add another small circle inside on the top left. And then color both of the eyes in black. And lastly, underneath each eye, let's add a curve down in the center. Next, let's hop up and in the center, let's draw a curve up and back down on both sides. And then let's draw a large curve out and curve it back in. And the same on the right. Now at the bottom, let's draw a small curved point. And then one more, but let's bring it back in to the beak. Next, let's move on top and let's draw a curve across. And then on the sides, let's add the ears. Let's start by bringing it out and flick it up at the end and curve it back down. And the same on the other side. Now let's draw two points going downwards. And then one more, but bring it back up to the head. And then inside each ear at the top, let's draw a zigzag line. And that's it for the head. Now let's move down and draw the body. Let's start on the bottom left of the head and let's draw a curve down. And then curve it back up. And now let's do the same on the right. Now let's move inside and let's add the details. Let's draw a curve down inside each of the wings. And then let's add a stripe pattern inside. Now in the outside part of the wings, let's draw a curved V-shape up at the bottom. Then another one on top. Then let's add two. One in the middle. And then two more on top. And that's it for the wings. Now let's move on to the body and draw the pineapple pattern. Let's start inside at the bottom and let's draw a curved V-shape up on the left and the right. Now let's add one on top in the middle and on the sides. Now let's continue this alternating pattern all the way up.
And when you're done, it should look like this. Next, inside each of these curves, let's draw an upside down V shape with a line down the center. And that's it for the body. Now let's move underneath and draw the feet. Let's start underneath on the left and let's draw two curved lines down. And the same on the right. Now from the bottom, let's draw a curve out and down underneath both sides. And then from the bottom, let's draw a wavy line back up to the center like this. Now let's draw two more toes behind on each foot. From the top left, let's draw a curve out and curve it back in. And the same on the right side. And now let's hop in and let's draw another smaller one behind each foot. And lastly, at the end of each toe, let's draw a small curve. And then color all of these in black. And that's it for the feet. Lastly, let's hop back up to the top and let's draw the top of the pineapple. Let's start on the top left of the head and let's draw a curve up and out. And then let's curve it back in. Now let's do the same thing on the top right. Now let's draw a point up in the center. And then another curved point on both sides. Then let's hop up and let's draw another set of two curves. Then a point up in the center. Another two curves, getting smaller as we go up. And then another set on top of this one. And now on top, let's draw one more taller one in the center. And then a set of taller ones next to it on the sides. Now lastly, inside each of these points, let's draw a curved line in the center. And that's it for the pineapple owl. Now let's quickly color it in. And done. Hope you enjoyed drawing along with me. And please remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.